Ezekiel 38, 22, God speaking of Gog, now called Turkey in end times. And I will plead against him with pestilence and with blood, and I will rain upon him, and upon his bands, and upon the many people that are with him, an overflowing rain. November 19th, 2023, Turkey. Overflowing rain. Record rainfall has caused rivers to break their banks forcing the government to declare an official state of emergency in hundreds of towns and villages with severe storms and flooding. At least three people were killed in the storms in the town of Eregli, while five people died in the southeastern provinces of Diyarbakir and Batman after being swept away by floodwaters caused by heavy rains. Bulgaria, gale force winds and heavy rain and snow claimed the lives of two people on Sunday and disrupted power supplies. Officials declared a state of emergency in the Black Sea city of Varna. Justice Minister Yilmaz Tunk said inmates had been transferred from Eregli's prison to surrounding facilities due to rising water levels. The Cameroon-flagged cargo ship Pallada broke into two due to heavy weather conditions after running aground in five-meter, 16-foot waves off Irigli. The Turkish-flagged Kafkametla sank on Sunday after hitting a breakwater outside the harbor off the town of Irigli, some 200 kilometers, 124 miles, east of Istanbul. Al Jazeera reports of worst floods in history in France, Europe. Widespread flooding in northern and eastern France has led to thousands of people having to evacuate their waterlogged homes, the collapse of roads, and the closure of schools and public buildings. November 19th, 2023, Iraq. Iraq is submerged. Storm, flash flood, landslide, wash away. Everything in seconds. November 23rd, 2023, Johannesburg, Africa. Flooding has Somalia in a state of emergency. Among the worst hit towns is the densely populated Bellad one, where the Shabelle River has burst its banks, destroyed many homes, and caused thousands to flee to higher ground near the border with Ethiopia. November 23rd, 2023, Australia flooding. Less than 24 hours since residents in parts of Australia's Victoria state fled bushfires, state authorities are now warning of flooding as heavy rain douses flames and lifts rivers in the southeastern state. Flash flooding is expected through Wednesday afternoon in northeastern Victoria, according to the Australian Bureau of Meteorology, as rain drenched parts of the state, where as recently as yesterday, around 17,000 hectares were ablaze. First responders overnight rescued a farmer in the area who got trapped after driving through floodwaters according to Chief Officer Operations Tim Wiebush at Victoria State Emergency Service. Also in the news is the insect infestation in Mecca. An extraordinary event at one of Islam's holiest sites, Mecca in Saudi Arabia, has taken place. During the Ramadan rains, the Grand Mosque was besieged by a massive swarm of locusts. This occurrence greatly disturbed the worshippers and compelled the authorities to embark on a large-scale cleaning operation. What could this plague of biblical proportions mean? And great hailstones. Hailstorms, November 22, 2023. Massive hailstones, wrecked cars and buildings. In China, a hailstorm swept through Changsha, China, destroying windshields and damaging rooftops and buildings. Also, a freak storm has dumped hail on Western Australia's wheat belt, turning paddocks white and destroying crops in the middle of harvest. Then finally, Coppel, Texas, population 38659, had 24 hail reports within 10 miles of the city centre, located in 2023. The largest report of hail in 2023, near Koppel, was 4.25 inches. And fire and brimstone. Fire and brimstone. November 19th, 2023. Catania, Italy. The Mount Etna volcano began erupting again on the island of Sicily Sunday, 
sending ash miles into the sky and raining down on Catania. November 21st, 2023. An eruption of Papua New Guinea's tallest volcano that raised regional tsunami fears subsided Tuesday. But thick ash still billowed into the sky and coated roofs and palm trees nearby. One of the South Pacific nation's most active volcanoes, Mount Ulawun, erupted on Monday, spewing ash as high as 15 kilometers, 50,000 feet. 3.6 earthquake in West Texas on November 18th, 2023. The quake, which occurred at 8.16 a.m. CST, about nine miles north-northeast of Hermley, or some 100 miles southeast of Lubbock, struck at a depth of 1.5 miles, according to the U.S. Geological Survey, USGS, Iceland volcano eruption may take place within 30 minutes. Notice Fagradalsfjall volcano in Iceland could erupt like a fountain of lava with just 30 minutes notice. Bill Maguire, a climate hazard expert, warns that fewer earthquakes could indicate an imminent eruption. Iceland's Meteorological Service issued an alert that molten magma is on the verge of surfacing. Professor Thorvaldur Thordeson suggests an area near the Svartsengi power plant is in a new eruption phase. A uh, coincidence? 